The story I'm about to tell you, she need to be on the world's dumbest criminal. Hi guys, it's me, your girl TK, and you're tuning in to TK Today. Today I'm coming to you with the story time, but before I get started, if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Tell a friend, send a smoke snigger, go ahead and support your girl. Tell a friend, tell a friend, as my cousin would say. Um, this story time that I'm telling today is, I swear to God, is the dumbest thing that a person can do if you're trying to steal something. The story time that I'm telling today is also including my cousin cooking with tips. She will not be on this with me today, on the video with me today, but she is including the story. So let me go ahead and get into it. So me and my cousin, we getting ready to go to one of our um, favorite cousin's uh, birthday bash that she's having. And so we're getting ready and cooking with tips. She just in her own world, baby. She like, and I'm snapping pictures and everything. So in the midst of us getting ready, we having a good time. We turned up, can't wait to get to the place. So when we get to the place on the way walk into like into because this was a club here in Jacksonville, Florida. Right. Anyway, so we get to the club and on the way walking through the parking lot, there's like this scene in the background, um, like this graffiti that's on this, or, or you might want to call it art, that's on this beautiful building. And she had on red, so as she was passing by, I was snapping pictures of her. I'm gonna put a couple up right now. Um, if you haven't already, you need to go ahead and follow her on Facebook, which is Tiffany Felder. So, we get into the club or whatever, and I'm just like, okay, what kind of club is this? Because it was dead. Um, the party that we were at, it was about 12 people there um, for the party that we was at. So, they were turned up. Um, we got there a little bit late, so we started drinking later than everybody else. Everybody was, was already turned up or whatever. So, anyway, the waiter that was waiting at our table, you know how sometimes, like, waiters, they get... Um, a lot of orders at one time so they frustrated or they forget this waiter that was helping us or whatever she i thought she was a cute girl i thought she was doing a damn thing or whatever but she you could tell that she was frustrated like she was getting caught here and there from our table and so um before i tell you what happened i can also tell you this i left the building twice so i don't know i ordered a plate of food i had two drinks I haven't got a receipt, I haven't paid, but I've walked to my car twice. Nobody stopped me, nobody, like if I was a criminal, I would've never came back, like. So anyway, <clears throat> so I'm sitting down to the table and she comes up to me, it's like at the end of the event. So she comes up to me and she hands me my ticket. And because I had been drinking, I was like, gave her the ticket back and I gave her 20. I don't have no bills with me y'all at this current time, but. I'm gonna demonstrate with a piece of paper, okay? So, she gave me my receipt. I gave it right back to her. And because I had like a bill fold with me, you, ladies, you know what I'm talking about, you don't have a lot of room in there. So all of my 20s was folded like this. Just like this. I know there's a big piece of paper, but imagine. So I had two 20s folded like this and I had two ones that were straight in my purse. I mean, in my bifold. So I gave her the um, receipt and then I gave her the 20 folder like this. So she went, I, she left the table. I seen her go over to the cash register or the little bar area. I didn't particularly see her go to the cash register, but I seen her go in the area. So I'm thinking she's cashing me out. But as she going over there, my cousin calling her like where our drinks at, we ordered them. You did not bring it to us. So she walks over to my cousin and was explaining she ordered Two round of drink. It was about one, get one free. She ordered two. She gave her four blase squads. I said, talking about that. So my cousin, like, whatever. I need another order. Then, you know, one order that should be two drinks. So she like, all right. My cousin gave her the money, cash. And she goes to the cash register. She comes back and give my cousin her money. I'm like, uh, what my change? She was like, you ain't give me no money. I was like, <laughs> so crazy. Girl, don't play with me. I was like, I don't been drinking. I don't have how time for this. Like, what would change at? Because I'm waiting on my change. I mean, you took my money before hers. And everybody at the table like, yeah, we saw you take her money. She was like, she did not give me no money. I said, yes, the bleeping I did. Like, what? So now I'm getting aggravated. Like, at first I'm thinking she playing with me. Am I getting punked or something around here? Because there's no way that I gave you the money in front of all these people. And, and you sitting up just trying to say that 
I didn't give you any money. So she leaves. She didn't say anything, but she was acting like she was looking. So she leaves and she talks to another waiter or whatever. And so that waiter comes over because I'm like, she's like, where the ticket at then? Where the ticket at? I was like, I gave the ticket back to you. How is you going to cash me out if you don't have my ticket? So anyway, she leaves and then she's talking to the other waiter or whatever. Then the waiter comes over like, mm -hmm. like she's looking. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Uh, like, I'm like, is you looking for the receipt? Cause the girl got it. Like in my head, I'm like, if I wanted to not pay when I walked out the first or the second time, I want to bring my ass back. Excuse my language. But I'm like, I wouldn't even came back. Like this makes that I'm not mad. So then I turn around and she just at the bar part, like it's a bar and then at the end of the bar is a, um, it's the cash register. So she's just at the bar like this, just sitting. Like, I don't know, I don't know where the money is. That's how she's looking at her face. So I'm just kept like, is she going? So it done been like 15 minutes, but she's still standing right there. So I got up from my chair and walked over to the bar. I was like, what's up? Like, you ain't found the money. She's like, you ain't give me no money. And then with the Latin, the little nasty, you ain't give me no money. You finna, you finna get punched. Like, are you serious? So it was like this gay dad, guy at the um register. And he was like, all I know is she did not cash you out. I said, all I know is I gave her a $20 bill folded and the ticket. So I was like, if, ain't, at this time, nobody had left the um the party when I gave her tickets. So I was like, you search any of us. There was no trash cans in this facility by the tables or nothing, but they got cameras everywhere. So I was like, um, pull the camera then. I was like, I ain't got nothing to hide. I was like, in my head, I'm like, they so dumb. Like I could have just walked out. So the dude was like, um, like I said, she ain't catch me. And I said, like I fucking said, excuse my language, y'all. Like I said, this is mainly an adult channel, so excuse my language, kids. Don't don't watch this. Don't watch none of my story time. Just just scratch that out. I need to put 18 over. Anyway, so he was like, there's no need to be cussing. Um, that is very disrespectful. There's no need to be disrespecting me. I said, I'm not trying to be disrespectful, first of all. Second of all, I'm cussing because she told me that I did not. I said, I'm not cussing at you. I'm talking to you about her. And I said, and she told me something I didn't pay her. The fuck? So they just looking dumb. And I said, that said, give me the owner, the manager, whoever. So he left. He was gone for a while. And that, no, wait, before I asked for the manager, the girl looking all around, she looking at all the receipts. And then it's a receipt that's sitting up there. And he, I was like, that's a receipt right there. She told me, oh, he just printed that out. Okay, y'all think this is dumb. Oh my God. So she, um, I no, I opened my wallet and I was like, I took out the 20 that was like this. I said, I had two 20s like this and I took out the ones. She, I don't know why she went in her pocket, but she went in her pocket and took out all of her tips. She had like all these ones, a five and the 20 that I gave her like this. So when she put the money on the counter, I said, there go my 20 right there. I said, it matched the one that's in my head. And then the gay guy was like, oh. yeah, go get your, um, cause she still was like, no, I, um, had tips. Before you, I said, who gave you a $20 tip? She couldn't answer that question. She just was like, like I said, I had tips before you. But like I said, who gave you a $20 in tips? Because they didn't have nobody in there. So because she did, I asked for the the manager. When the guy came up, there was a nice older guy, um, like a 60 or something like that. And he said he was the owner. So I looked him straight. His eye took out my ID. Um, I have a S10. A Galaxy S10. Um, and you know you can go to the settings and give you the telephone number. I had both of them. Bam. Look. I was like, first of all, I gave her a $20 bill. And I just ran over the store. I gave her a $20 bill. She walked over to this area. I thought she went to the to the cash register. My cousin called her. She was talking to her about drinks. And then that got mixed up. And then she cashed her drinks out. And when she brought her money back, I asked her where my change at. All of a sudden, I didn't get her no, no 20 she said I didn't get her no money, but everybody over here saw her. So I was like, if I'm lying, here go my ID, here go my um, phone number, and I said, and pull the cameras. So he asked me again, I said it again, and then he was like, he looked at her, and then this is what I said, I was like, and I said, and then she's so dumb, she put all her money on the counter, and she put my 20 on her pocket, because it's right there, and it matched this, and he, even his face was like, and then he looked at her, 
and he turned back i said so all i want is my money back i said i meant my change back i said that change was gonna be her tip but she ain't getting no damn tip now nah, like nah so um he whispered something they had music playing he whispered something to her and then he made her give me the change back or whatever out of her tips so and that was pretty much it but i was still mad like she, she just straight tried me like for real like do i look like anyway so later on when we were leaving um the owner came up to my cousin and they were talking and i walked over to him and was like listen you got my telephone number because he he didn't write it down he didn't care about the id he was like i just he, he was like i believe he was telling the truth because you were just so adamant about what you were saying you was telling me to pull the cameras and then he couldn't pull them because they didn't even work so you just got play play cameras around in your really you just got play play cameras anyway he was saying he was like um that it's been money coming up short and she's always saying the one that's there and always saying that she don't know what's going on and then this happens so he was like it's something that he's gonna have to deal with i was like oh i wasn't trying to get you fired boo anyway like i said this story time wasn't all that great but have you ever been tried like why i, I don't know i just feel like i be getting tried all the time so i just i don't know i had to get it out and so i just feel like i would do a story time on it anyway i have other story times if you go into my story time category you um there's a story about when i went to philly and it was crazy it's two parts to it so if i'll include those links in this video no, I'm sorry. I include the links in, in the description below. And again, go ahead and support your girl. If you haven't, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Share, like, put it on your um, timeline, your social medias. And um, I will be doing a Lion King review. If you haven't seen any of my movie reviews, you may want to tune into those. I do current movie reviews but i also do current movies late as well because sometimes i want to include those links in in the um, movie review and sometimes they will not let you do that on new movies like the one i will be doing with the lion king speaking of lion king i will be doing a giveaway me and my cousin cooking with tip like i said she has a ton of subscribers we're going to do the lion king review together we have three toy sets from that movie that I, I don't even think is out yet you may be able to get it on ebay we're not giving all three of them away we're gonna let the winner pick which one they want and that's it so again guys thank you for tuning in um you are talking to tk today i'm sorry guys i had got anyway until next time 